All right, real quick, we're gonna take a look at the Hydrophobe, uh, which you probably just got if you're watching this video. Uh, when you do get your Hydrophobe, just know uh, you are 100% responsible for sealing the uh, body of the Hydrophobe up, as well as sealing up the camera if you wanna get it all waterproof, uh, including using the E6000 that we provide, as well as the antenna plugs that go in the holes here. Uh, you'll need to make sure that you uh, take the top plate off as well as uh, the bottom skirt and you're going to put a bead of that seal or that sealant all the way around making sure it gets nice and, and gooped in there the right way uh, and it gets sealed up then you screw everything back in you're going to want to also make sure you do any of these open holes on the bottom if they have any screw holes uh, you're going to want to put some uh, sealant up in those don't forget around the strap also your battery where the battery leads come out as well as our new USB relocator. This USB relocator uh, gives you access to the flight controller. Uh, so you can access the flight controller and check all the settings uh, right out the box without having to open it. That being said, if you have a DJI version, you will have to open up the skirt. We recommend taking the bottom screws, those two, those two, this one, this one and then those two there and when you take those off you'll be able to gently lift the skirt up a little bit and you should be able to access the bind button on whichever side it's on um, once you have that bind button press and you bind it to your goggles and or your dji radio uh, you should be good to go by just plugging in the usb so you shouldn't have to really get in there and do too much other than just binding that way if you have a crossfire, we should have reset the crossfire receiver for you to where you should be able to bind to it out the box without having to actually open it up. This means that if you have an analog version with crossfire, you don't have to open it. You should be able to bind and you should be able to then just plug in at the USB port and you can access and set up your drone. Anytime you get one of these bind and flies from us, you always want to set it up in beta flight, check all your switches, check everything set up the way you want as far as rates. It is tested, tuned, and ready to go. Uh, if you have any questions, let us know. Hopefully this video helps you out. Last thing, props are standard rotation. So the trailing sharp edge is gonna be that way right now. It's gonna be that way, that way, and that way. Fly safe, fly smart, just fly, peace.